Good afternoon, Alexander Marks with the Nevada State Education Association speaking in support of Senate Bill 227. NSCA works tirelessly to dismantle systems of oppression to advance racial and social justice for our members and our students. I'm a Jewish man. I grew up hearing about stories from my grandmother about seeing signs that stated no Jews or dogs at the pool, hearing about swastikas carved into students, and even knowing cousins whose parents met in concentration camps. We are not that far removed from 1920. Throughout my life, I've experienced anti-Semitism in various forms similar to my colleague Elliot. The last five to six years have been quite scary to be a Jewish person in America. We've seen the growth of anti-Semitism across the U.S. fueled by a more brazen white supremacy movement no longer content with hiding behind their hoods. Anti-Semitism exists, and it has a symbol. Things mean what they mean, and SB 227, or 277 seems to understand that. With this country's history, the noose has always meant much more than a knot in a rope. It's a reminder of America's dark history of racial violence. This was a tool to kill people. It is by its very nature seen as a threat. I've experienced this throughout my life. Some people who love to point out that swastikas existed long before the 1920s. However, we all know what that symbol means to this day, and we know why people are using it. Intent matters, and we know why people are using it. Um, never in my life have I experienced a situation where someone has said the word swastika and someone has asked, do you mean the Nazi swastika for clarification? White supremacists are not using Buddhist swastikas to intimidate outside of synagogues or on school lockers. This bill and the amendment, I believe, makes that clear. These symbols have hate meanings that won't go away. They exist forever, and I doubt we will ever see the day where a Jewish person like myself will ever see a swastika as anything but a symbol of hate and intimidation. When racism and anti-Semitism occur, we all bear the responsibility to decry it and work to remove it. In its efforts of social and racial justice, NSEA simply stands on the side that hate is hate and not using these symbols to intimidate or at all would be the best path forward for our students and society. This is a bill worthwhile.